it. <laughs> What's up, guys? Uh, listen, this has been a busy, busy week. Y'all seen us in the last clip. We were up in Gainesville um, hanging out with Todd. Todd was going through the Frank Holly's driving school. He did amazing. It started raining, so we had to leave. Plus, we had to head down to get ready to head down to Fort Lauderdale to pick up prenup. Y'all know we are on a time crunch. We are actually, I think, two weeks before the first race. Yeah, today's Thursday. So uh, the event starts on Thursday in Ohio, uh, June 2nd, I believe. So we are actually two weeks from the first event of Street Outlaw No Prep King season six. So the game plan is to go down and get the car today, get it completely 100% done, brought back home, take this weekend, go through the whole entire car, and then we're going to get ready so we can test on Monday. Um, game plan is to test Monday and Tuesday, and then once we get done with all that, we'll figure out what we got to do to get ready for the first race. Is there a check? Okay. So we got, we just got, I just got a check in. So shout out sponsorship. I don't know who sends it in yet, but appreciate it. Got it. Um, so like I said, we're going to go hook up real quick. Why do you put water inside the water? Just to throw it out. She's going out of her mind, guys. My mom doesn't like to be filmed. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to up the, the camera angles around the house. And we're going to film a lot more. Uh, skylar has been doing good. That's another thing I want to talk about real quick. Having a video and editor guy. Plus, Slinky has been amazing. The first two weeks of work have been awesome. We've been knocking some stuff out. They've been taking the load off of me. I don't know why I said it like that, but, um, and uh, I've been able to get more stuff done. So yes, we are going to up the camera angles so we can get more of mom on the channel. Right here, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Skylar, you, you work for me? Yeah. Well, so you listen to me? So let's head out. Let's get let's get hooked up to the the new stabbing cabin, the new dually. Um, we're gonna see how she pulls with the new trailer that we just bought. Um, Y'all seen the old bumper pull trailer we had? It was a 24 footer. I did just buy a 34 footer. Got it ready for this year. Uh, we do need some smaller to be able to hit the street races this year. We can't be going out there with the big rigs. I did buy a 34 footer, but we're gonna go hook up to it. We're gonna head down to Fort Lauderdale, and in today's video, you will get to see the brand new color and wrap that we put on prenup. Yeah, you ain't even got to see it yet, have you? Exactly. Know your role. I've created it. She can't. She don't even know where the underwear is at in the house. How she create the wrap? Watch out! There's dog shit around here. So there's mounds of it. You gotta like little landmines. I know people. Y'all got dogs at your house, right? Oh yeah. Do they? Uh, and, and they got. They got. They got landmines around here. And then you gotta watch Slinky too. Slinky will just fucking pop down and, and take a shit in the yard as well. Huh? Why'd you hook the trailer up, man? What happened? What do you mean? Huh? Gotcha. Motherfucker. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> let's go let's hook up to that trailer. First time we get the pool, the new trailer. Oh yeah! Look at that. The weight of the trailer. They didn't even. They didn't even do nothing to this thing. <laughs> We're gonna get to see how the new trailer pulls. We're gonna get to see how the new truck pulls the trailer. Got a lot of stuff going on this week. I like. I like it. I like it. So, do you know why you cross the chains? Yes. What's the reason? The reason is, is if. They decide they wanted to come undone from the hitch that it cradles it whenever it falls. The idea is that this right here, this cross will catch the tongue of the trailer. Always knew you were a blower. You fit it in your mouth? Probably. Am I going to? No. You good. We don't need that, dude. We will not need that. Uh, Make shit. sure we always unhook that. Look, hold up. You see the lights? Lights are on. Lights are working. When the hell did you hook this up? Ben hooked it up. This thing's set up. Just turn it, dumbass. Let me, let me do it. You go. You gotta fuck it up, son. This fucking thing. This guy. Just let it hang down here. Let it hang right here so it doesn't get run over. Dude, he's like, he, I swear to God, he's like, he's like a little kid. 
Got it. Got it. You gotta hold it. You want me to hold your hand? I want to put it up. You want me to hold your hand? I want to put it up. You want me to, where are you gonna put it up at? I'll Where? start walking around and hanging up over You there. were not going to do that. You were going to put it right underneath the front tire. Huh? And then you left it open. You left it open. Bitch, you got to grab him here. <laughs> <laughs> Let me pull out. Oh, you're going Look bad. We got about T minus four hours till we're in Fort Lauderdale and we get to get the first look at the car. What new shirt? Black we're gonna get black. a little quick merch plug in. We got the black on black JSR Justin Swanson Racing. Guys, you can get yours at www.justinswanson69.com. It's very comfortable, very true to size. Shout out to everybody that's actually talking about the weight loss. I love it. It's actually good and good. We got Slinky getting on the program too. Mm -hmm. We don't know what the hell we can do for Skyler. Gotta get me bigger yeah, instead right. of slimming me down. We're, he has to eat. I eat. We're not allowed to eat. Yeah. So we eat. It's, I mean, yesterday we cheated a little bit, but it's okay. Guys, you just, whatever you do, just make sure you do good at it. And so even though, listen, I'm not, I'm not a fucking bodybuilder. I, I don't. I just, I wanted to be a little healthier. I have Todd Hormone Logics. Shout out to him. And if y'all want to, y'all click the link in the description. Y'all can reach out to him and he can help you too. And just by listening to people and doing it and trying to stay consistent, it's helped me. I'm down about 40. Well, I was down 47. I gained about six of it back. And then I lost about nine. So I would say around 50 pounds right now. So I'm, I'm down right now. I'm, I'm feeling good. I need to get down another 25 pounds. That's the goal. And then I'll figure out where we're going to go from there. But uh, I, I feel good. I feel amazing. My arm's working out and everything in the gym. I'll tell you, like, right now my arms are kind of locked up. So it can't really it can't really straighten out. So it does look a little weird. But um, we're getting ready. But, man, I, I am admiring the new toe pick. Badass. Hell, yeah. All right. Let's head to Fort Lauderdale. So y'all remember how I told you about my, my dreaming? Mm -hmm. like I've been dreaming a lot here lately. I don't know why, but it is. But when I dream, I'm like superstitious about it. So we didn't drive the dually, we didn't do that. We're good, we're past that. Well, I had a dream last night. Kind of, kind of fucked up, I ain't gonna lie. So I met, you know, I met my, uh, my celebrity crush. Now, old Swifty, old Swifty. Hey, I had all the angles. Everything's rolling good. I'm fuck. I'm in there like swimwear. Like I fucking, I done, you know, the fucking numbers about to come to me. I done asked, got everything. She hit me with the, if you can name five of my songs, you can have whatever. I went blank. <laughs> I went blank. <laughs> so listen to this shit. The only song that I could think of was Shake It Off. <laughs> so I hit her with the, I'm, I just shook it off. <laughs> I'm trying to shake the nerves off so I can keep talking to you. Cause I'm nervous as shit right now. And I don't get nervous. I'm not a nervous person, but I was so fucking nervous. And then I couldn't think of nothing. I just kept stuttering and kept speech impediment. I couldn't get it out. And she hit me with the, well, sorry. <laughs> he couldn't name five songs. And I fucking woke up like that. <laughs> I was so fucking pissed. <laughs> oh my God. You know what you gotta do now though, right? Hey. You gotta study. So gotta, if that ever happens. <laughs> oh my God, I gotta, I gotta I'm gonna have to study. <laughs> But dude, it, it, dude I, I'm surprised. Like it was so good. Like everything was rolling. I had all the, I had I had the riz rolled up. We were doing good, Slink. The riz. Got it, dude. I tell you, I, I mean, I had her face to face. And we were fucking knocking it out, and everything was good. And I just hit it. I said, hey, you know, after you do this show, you'd like to hang out. Can I get your number? And she hit me immediately. If you can name five of my songs, you can have it. And I, I shut down. <laughs> that was it. I was like, man, what the fuck? So now I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna get up and get back up on mine. Now, when I woke up in the morning, 
I, 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 I was that good. Everything was good. I, I could name off songs. We were, we were sitting. He right. woke up naming songs. Is what he did. Man, I was, I was so disappointed, dude. I was disappointed in myself. I'm not gonna lie. Property is just as much. We already have that. We're permanent. We gotta go get cut that color, dude. I wanna get, I wanna get a head sheet tattoo. I think I'm gonna get one right here. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> Slink used to try to get me, but listen, there ain't, there ain't too much more there to grab right now. Yeah, man, I was I was disappointed in myself last night, dude. My performance just wasn't there. Sometimes you have that. Sometimes you gotta take a pill. I have to take a memory pill. I'll tell you, bro. I, I never I never get nervous like that, and I, I and I, even though I was dreaming, I was nervous. That's a high priority woman right there, Slink. Yes, sir, son. I'd rather have Lady Wilson. That's a high priority level woman right there. That is a independent, self efficient goddess. I ain't gonna lie, man. I probably, I'm telling you, dude, I, I don't know. I, I'm being honest with you. I'd probably do anything for Taylor. Anything. Anything. Yeah. What's, what's next? What's next on the docket, man? Uh, we're going down to pick up the car. We got to come back. We're going testing Monday and Tuesday. You Hopefully, test we're testing Orlando. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, uh, uh, testing goes good. If we need to stay there a couple more days, we plan on doing that. And then the following week, we're two weeks out from the first race. So. Oh, really? Yeah, we got to go to Ohio for the first race. And then after that, it's Virginia. Virginia to Minnesota. Minnesota to Kentucky. Kentucky it's to on, New buddy. Hampshire. All in June. That's only June. Appreciate it. You Thank got you, it, buddy. Guys, take care. Yes, sir. Y'all be safe out there. You too. Got Thank me on you. camera? Yes, sir. <laughs> if you had to listen to one song for 24 hours straight on repeat for a million dollars, what would the song be? Mine would be uh, Anti Hero, Taylor Swift. Mine would be um, somewhere from um, like a Dove Cameron, Cameron voice um, from the Descendants movies. Yeah. Really anti-hero? Yeah, I don't I don't like that. Bro, that song gets stuck in my head. I hate that. I'm the problem. I hate that. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stand this shit. <laughs>
for other, uh, I guess, would you say patients or would you say people? I mean, people. Yeah. Pe people with, uh, with the same illness. Breast cancer is an illness, right? Mm -hmm. Disease, I believe. Disease. So, uh, with the same uh, style of disease. So, it sucks and I hate it that they're going through that. And uh, trust me, it's uh, it's been a rough deal, especially even Kai. Like, dude, Kai, Kai calls me, I call Kai at least two, three times a week. And that first phone call when he, he called me and uh, he broke down on the phone, I knew immediately that it was going to be something serious. Like, there was no joking beside it. And then I didn't even know how serious it was until he told me exactly how serious it is. And then uh, so, you know, I've been there the whole time just making sure everything's going good and if I can help them at any point, there's really nothing I can do, but I think they're going to really enjoy this wrap and they ain't even got to see it yet. So when y'all see it is when they're going to get to see it too. So we're going to go in there, we're going to work on it, we're going to get everything done and then we are going to reveal it to y'all and we can take the car back home. By now guys, y'all have got to see the car and I hope y'all like it as much as I do. I mean, I think it's badass. I love it. I love the, uh, the ribbon on top, shout out. Um, like I said in the beginning of this video, we did this for a deal towards Lizzie, um, breast cancer and anybody out there that, that has that, uh, an awareness for it. They're out there yelling like hell. But uh, dude, the rap came out badass. We got the Hormone Logic. Shout out to Todd at Hormone Logics for helping us out get back on board this year so we got him on we're putting a wing on um we are a little bit late to the party but we're gonna get everything done cleaned up get it back home so we can get everything ready moving forward but man mike cammy the people over here at speed and truck world they knocked this thing out it looks badass and um in my opinion i feel like it's the best looking car and best looking wrap on the mpk circuit um, it, it's got a meaning behind it and I'm putting everything I can into the program and into racing this year to go out there and try to win as many races as we can, take home that championship and take home the team championship. That's right, there's two different championships this year. There is an individual championship points championship and there is a team points championship. So um, it's, gonna be, it's gonna be a stressful year, it's gonna be a long year, but we're ready for it. But what do you think about the wrap? I think it looks great. I think it came out badass. Some other little pink parts got on yep, it. Yeah, just... but there's still more stuff that gotta add back here. That's why we're trying to get everything on. But once we get everything on, then they'll be able to finalize it. Then we get the stickers on for the sponsors, and then we're good to go. <laughs>
Bye, Cammy. Bye. Thank you. Man. All right, guys. So, whew, it's been a long day. What time is it? It's 8.30. Well, what time we get home? About 2 a.m. So, we got, it's been a long drive here. Long day working. Um, hopefully, y'all like the car. Um, I love it. I think it come out badass. It's got a good meaning behind it. Uh, we're praying for Lizzie. We've been praying for her the whole time. Uh, hope she can uh, battle this deal, beat it. And uh, like I told her, we got a lot more racing to do, uh, me and her. So uh, uh, it, it's going to be a fun deal. Cammy, Mike, everybody, they knocked it out the park. They did good. Um, they, they always do my wraps. Everything comes out badass from here. Uh, to be able to come up with the pink color and the ribbon and everything, Cammy actually came up with the, the as it, it, it glows in the dark. Um, what's the actual terminology for it? Like, reflective? Yeah, there you go, reflective. See, she's a lot smarter than I am. Don't stop it! Don't, don't, <laughs> don't go there. You're doing, you're doing too much. But anyways, it reflects in the uh, at night, so it looks badass. Uh, we'll drop some photos so y'all can see what it looks like at night, and then like when a camera flash hits it. Um, I think it's different. Uh, there's, I don't think there's anybody else out there that has it. No, so, so it's it's pretty dope. But uh, um, I'm happy with it. I'm happy how everything turned out. We got a four and a half hour ride home, and then. The real work starts we're gonna got we got to get dry shaft in we got to gear gear change we got to go over the whole entire car um we were struggling getting the car up in the trailer because it's sitting too low up front we got to raise it up we got to get everything ready and then we're going to get it all scaled weighed out because we are going testing monday and tuesday and if we got to stay there extra days we are because we are two weeks officially two weeks from the first street outlaw no prep kings race and uh i want to make sure that we're ready to go I spent a bunch of money this year to be able to uh, be up front, have the best of the best, and uh, I want to give my team the best of the best. So I put the right people around me, me in the driver's seat, the right program down inside the car, and hopefully we can go out there and win a few races and see if we can bring home the championship. If y'all haven't done it already, make sure you subscribe to the channel, turn that bell notification on, keep liking the videos. That's what helps drive this thing. Uh, we're on the road for 100,000 subscribers. I'll see y'all at the next video.